This video will introduce you to the incredible journey of sperm and egg as they move towards each other and prepare for fertilization. Sperm have a much longer distance to travel, so let's start with their journey. A human sperm measures only 0.05 millimeters in length, but it has to travel through 30 to 40 centimeters of male and female reproductive tract to reach an egg. The remarkable journey of a sperm begins inside the testes, in highly coiled tubules called seminiferous tubules. This is where sperm production occurs. Sperm are then transferred into the epididymis, where they become motile, and then the ductus deferens, where sperm are stored prior to their release. During ejaculation, sperm are propelled into the ejaculatory ducts and urethra, here, sperm mix with secretions from the seminal vesicles and prostate gland to form a fluid called semen. At ejaculation, semen is released into the vagina. Sperm swim through the vagina to the cervix, enter the uterus, and then head towards the oviduct. In the oviduct, sperm undergo a maturational process called capacitation. Capacitation is essential for fertilization and it has two effects on sperm. Firstly, capacitation hyperactivates sperm tails, so they beat really fast and sperm can quickly reach an egg. And secondly, capacitation triggers the release of enzymes from the sperm head. This is called the acrosome reaction. These enzymes digest a pathway through the protective coats around the egg so that a sperm can fertilize an egg. This incredible sperm journey is long and hazardous, but how does it compare to an egg's journey? Well, an egg has less distance to travel and it doesn't undergo maturational changes like a sperm. But its journey is still important. At ovulation, an egg is released from the ovary. The finger-like fimbri of the oviduct collect the egg and bring it into the oviduct. An egg has to move along the oviduct, but it doesn't have a tail, so how does egg movement occur? Well, the cells that line the oviduct are covered with motile, hair-like extensions called cilia. Cilia sweep in the direction of the uterus, which rolls the egg along the oviduct. To summarise, the sperm and egg journeys are long and hazardous, but they're essential for successful fertilisation. Next, you'll be able to explore sperm and egg migration and maturation in more detail.